welcome to in jamaica and if this is your first time here please subscribe click the notification bell and stick around to see places in jamaica centipedes are predatory arthropods belonging to the class chilopodia of the subphylum myriapodia an arthropod group which also includes millipedes and other multi-legged creatures. In Jamaica, centipedes are popularly referred to as 40 legs and their size can range from a few millimeters to about 30 centimeter, approximately 12 inch. They are elongated metameric creatures with a rounded or flattened head, bearing a pair of antennae at the forward margin and one pair of legs per body segment. The first pair of legs at the head end of the centipede acts as sense organs, similar to antennae, but unlike the antennae of most other animals, theirs point backwards. Many species of centipedes lack eyes, but some possess a variable number of ocelli which are sometimes clustered together to form true compound eyes. However, these eyes are only capable of discerning light and dark and have no true vision. They normally have a dark coloration combination shades of brown and red. Centipedes can be found in a wide variety of environments from tropical rainforests to deserts. Accordingly, they are found in soil, leaf litter, under stones, under dead wood, and inside logs. They require a moist microhabitat because they lack the waxy cuticle of insects, therefore causing them to rapidly lose water. Most centipedes are generally venomous and can inflict painful bites, injecting their venom through pinchers like appendages known as forcipers. Forcipers are unique features found only in centipedes and in no other arthropods. Some species of centipedes can be hazardous to humans because of their bite. While a bite to an adult human is usually very painful and may cause severe swelling, chills, fever and weakness, it is unlikely to be fatal. However, the bites can be dangerous to small children and those with allergies to bee stings. The venomous bite of the larger centipedes can introduce anaphylactic shock in such people. The non-venomous centipedes are considered frightening due to their dozens of legs moving at the same time and their tendency to dart swiftly out of the darkness towards one feet. Despite the name centipedes, notably prefix centi referring to 100, centipede can have a varying number of legs ranging from 30 to 354. Just a reminder, in Jamaica, this centipede is referred to as 40 leg, and I counted the number of legs on this centipede, and interestingly, there are 40 legs. Each pair of legs is slightly longer than the pair immediately in front of it, ensuring that they do not overlap, so reducing the chance that they will collide with each other while running. In extreme cases, the last pair of legs may be twice the length of the first pair. The final segment bears a telsa and includes the openings of the reproductive organs. Centipede reproduction does not involve copulation. Males deposit a spermatophore for the female to take it up. In one clade, this spermatophore is deposited in a web 
and the male undertakes a courtship dance to encourage the female to engulf his sperm. In other cases, the males just leave them for the females to find. In temperate areas, egg laying occurs in spring and summer, but in subtropical and tropical areas, little seasonality to centipede breeding is apparent. Centipedes are predominantly generalist predators, which means they have adapted to eat a variety of different available prey. As a food item, certain large-sized centipedes are consumed in China, usually skewered and grilled or deep-fried. They are often seen in street vendors' stalls in large cities. Also in China, as well as in Thailand and other areas, large centipedes are kept in liquor for a period of time. This custom is allegedly part of the traditional Chinese medicine. Said to have medicinal properties and to be reinvigorating, the liquor with the centipede submerged in it is consumed as a special drink. Please remember to subscribe to In Jamaica. Give us a like and share and thank you all for watching.